Hello everyone, it is so nice to talk to you again about Christmas. Isaiah prophesied about this season a long time ago because he talked about Jesus. He prophesied, he said, Therefore, the Lord himself will give you a sign. Behold, a virgin shall conceive and bear a son and will call his name Emmanuel. Thank God for that. You see, Isaiah prophesied about the virgin birth. It's very important that we realize that over the years, this was already planned and ordained by Father God. This was already something in the works, in the making. And God was so faithful that he brought it to fruition. He said a virgin shall bring forth a son. And that's very important because the virgin birth matters. Because it reveals in part who Jesus will be. He is our Messiah. On Christmas morning, Mary held in her hands the God of heaven wrapped in human flesh. Just think about that just for one moment. The God of heaven, the God of the universe, our creator. Imagine her looking into the eyes of eternity. That must have been so awesome for her. It must have been a magnificent thing for her to do. Can you imagine that? Just put yourself in her shoe. He is not just an important religious figure or prophet. No, he is. He is not. He is not just a, somebody, another prophet. But he is our God and our creator. He came to save us. He was born to save us from our sins. Very important to make that distinction. And we just praise the Lord for that. The heart of Christmas is that this God man, this man, our God in or clothed in man's flesh is a fulfillment of hundreds of prophecies to identify that God has come. Imagine that, God with man, amen. That sounds so wonderful. He left his glorious and magnificent throne and he dwelt with us. And you know what? We praise the Lord because he is still with us. Praise the name of Jesus. Let us, as we go through this Christmas, not only focus on the things around us, our loved ones, our families, our friends, but let us give thanks to Father God knowing that we know that Christmas is not just another day, but we're commemorate, commemorating a time when God came and dwelt with man. Thank you so much.